so chef we have a question that how was your michelin journey like could you please ex explain us sorry uh, sorry i can't hear you what what is uh, that okay so i will repeat how was your michelin uh, michelin journey so uh michelin journey let me explain you the procedure i think uh, i think everybody should know this um so the michelin is a brand which is from france which was started in france and michelin is actually a tire company guys yes you all are right i'm sure a lot of people think about it yaar yeah, michelin to tires hai michelin to tire yes it is a tire company and they started off with a garage where they had a good very good uh, cafe and it was recognized by a lot of french people and that's where all this michelin thing started years long ago long ago i don't even know when did it start but um, that's how it works so if any restaurant is getting michelin recognized or a michelin star it starts from the team of reservations they call up to check do the reservations they double check if the reservationist knows the menu of the restaurant and if she knows about the food she knows what the brand is about they ask this kind of question before they do the booking and that's where all it starts if your reservationist doesn't know your brand like I always said restaurant ka jo samne ka facade hota hai that's the most important thing then at the back it starts from there then they come in before coming in sometimes they double check they call them up to check if the booking is still there they check they check to see if somebody is picking up the call if it's mentioned 6 o'clock if somebody is still picking up the call till 6 o'clock they come into the restaurant they like to be greeted well they like to be given the menus well they like to be sat down well they like the server to be very professional and they start asking you the server lot of questions and they don't come up with a diary ki diary leke baith gaye aur notes bana rahe they are very smart inspectors you would not even recognize that it's a michelin inspector sitting in your restaurant my inspector when we had a farzi review he came on a saturday evening shift at 8:30 which is a busiest shift of the week so they came in uh, sat down they all, they or started asking the questions to the server uh, he was a proper uh, english guy um and then i remember they started look because we have a show kitchen in farzi cafe london um they started looking at they started he there was two of them he started coming on the pass to check uh, what's going on at the back if the kitchen was clean whatever he could see because it was a very it's a very uh, uh kitchen which you can have a conversation with the chefs you can talk to the chefs so something like that um then they started talking to me and luckily i was there that day um he went back he ordered drinks he went on the bar he checked with the bar guys how how they making the cocktails he spoke to them as well then he he asked the questions to the waitress about uh, so much food and how do they manage it and blah 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 so after that um, he had the food he tasted the food and while we was while the waitress was serving the food uh, there were questions being asked to the waitress they were checking the they definitely do check the fold of napkin i don't know what is it about with uh, napkins and french people but they definitely do check that um then they um, started calling us outside once their uh, food was done i was called on the table and that's when they introduce that yes we are michelin inspectors we came here and we want to give you the recognition of michelin um that's when we found out that uh, you know he's been there he clicked the pictures but the way he clicked the pictures we didn't knew that he was clicking the pictures he was just walking around and randomly clicking the pictures of the restaurant they even checked the toilets they even check how is the if the toilets have been sanitized well if they are clean they because in their michelin uh, recognition they mention all these points as well they look at the local area how busy is the street how busy is the what is the type of guest we get in the restaurant and what is our average spend 
because if you go on the Michelin guide, you will see the all the restaurants will have the average spend as well. What's the best part about the restaurant and everything? Uh, for a Michelin star, the process is equally the same, but the standards are a bit higher. They dig in too deep for Michelin star. Um, yes, you. It's not that dif difficult to get it, but it's not that easy as well to get it. So that's why I think I, when I spoke to Shri sir, I said consistency is the key. They come twice a year, and if the product is not consistent, if even your presentation has changed, but it has to look the spot on presentation. It needs to be clean plating. It needs to be really good food, tasteful food. When, and especially when you serve Indian food, it's all about flavors and well, well balanced flavor. Like, and also it should, every meal has to look the same. That's all about Michelin. If it doesn't look the same, you lose it. If you lose the consistency, you lose it.